what's up everybody let's try installing iPad OS on this iPad so it's a fifth generation 32 gigabyte iPad I got Xcode installed on my hard drive because I literally have no space in here um, look at that 13 gigabits left so we look up the file uh, so you can look up the file and just download it from one of your sources whatever and once you download it you know throw it on your desktop it's all right here it's like four gigabytes and you have to have the Xcode running so we have that running and iTunes so we're gonna try connecting the iPad into the computer and see if we can install the new iPad OS so uh so once we're in there all right let's give it a try trust all right so check this out a new ipad let's click continue get started okay let's do an update but what you gotta do is basically you gotta click option and update and it's gonna take you into the file manager we go to desktop and let's see which one it is so this is the iPad one so we click on it okay and I check this out iTunes will update your iPad to iOS 3 13.0 let's give it a try don't Look at that, that's kind of exciting. It's kind of dirty. This is going to be the worst. It's going to be, it's going to be the worst video online. But you know what? I'm going to have a video. So uh, if you like this, please subscribe to my channel and follow me and share me on, you know, Twitter. Instagram Facebook and reddit of course and I'm very sorry about this quality it just I'm not ready for it but you know what okay let's put a code again put our code again all right let's see what's gonna happen so you just restart it and uh, I have to have this thing pinched in like this because it was moving and it wasn't working properly. It would turn off and turn on so I can't even breathe in here or else it's gonna mess up. So this is like, this is what you don't wanna do. First of all, you wanna have enough space in your hard drive. That's number one. Second of all, you wanna be running um, Mac OS, uh, 12.14.4 in order for it to work and it would be nice if you clean your screen and this is a uh, my kids iPad and I had literally 30 gigabytes of uh, games I had to just erase because I had zero uh, zero memory in here so hopefully this video is gonna be very very tweaker choppy but uh, hopefully it's gonna get the job done and uh, it might work out for you who knows you know I'm not gonna get all fancy and I'm just recording out of my iPhone 7 and next video hopefully, hopefully it's gonna be better because I'm gonna be updating the iPhone 7 the next day and uh, let's go so I think it's finally done look at that Look at that. I don't think I need this anymore. Let's give this thing a try. No, we don't speak Chinese. Come on. Press home button. Dark mode. Let's go. Look at that. Continue. Welcome to iPad. Look at that. 
software version 13.0 let's give this thing a try people I couldn't wait I just couldn't wait I had to do the same thing to my iPhone and check this out it's installing the iOS 13 on my iPhone I feel very excited I guess I'm just gonna make one video that does two things because it's exactly the same thing and I'm using my wife's phone it just I couldn't wait I'm not gonna wait here all day I want to play with it after after I'm done with work so uh, it's the same exact procedure exactly the same procedure as a iPad or iPhone it just you put a, a put in the different file and that's all you gotta do so what's what's the point of making two videos maybe eventually I will make a second video if it's gonna start ranking but um, who knows it's gonna be the worst video online I mean this doesn't get any worse I got the accent uh, the setup is really crappy in here I'm in the light box come on who else does a video in the light box look at that and it's a iPhone 7 and I did all the speed test on Geekbench so we're gonna see what are, what is the difference which device is going to be faster you know the previous or I mean the previous or the the new one I'm so excited I can't even speak English today and, and it only it took probably like half an hour to do the whole thing check this out people my iPhone just updated to iOS 13 and I thought it crashed it's kind of freaking me out a little bit but it looks like it's working dark let's do dark Check this out. I just did a Geekbench test run and uh, the score is horrible on an iPhone 7. Hopefully it's gonna slowly improve with the updates. Well, thank you so much. If you like this, subscribe, share, like.